it is unfortunate to hear even today that there are many myths around the topic of eclipse and people still consider eclipses as something of a bad omen and something that can affect in us in a negative way for instance there seems to be a special danger to pregnant women and their unborn children and they are restricted from going outside they are requested to stay indoors for their own safety in many parts of india people tend not to eat during the eclipse uh, they believe that uh, the pre cooked food or food that is cooked during the eclipse uh, tends to get spoiled um, or gets deteriorated and it is unfit for consumption um part of the belief comes uh, from the fact that the sun's rays are blocked so the explanation is that the temperature drops suddenly and uh, that allows microbes or germs to uh, stay alive in the food and um, if the sun's rays were present they could also kill those germs so in the absence of those sun's sun's rays uh there's chance for uh, germs or microbes to grow in the food and uh, thus uh, such food is unfit for consumption and it should be thrown away however there is no such evidence to support this belief they also say that pregnant women should stay away from sharp objects um because it may cause their uh, baby to be uh, born with a cleft lip or uh, with some physical deformities many of the ancient civilizations believed that uh, solar eclipse uh, was um as a result of a bite being taken out of the sun um and uh, so it was something to be feared from um something that is very evil also the moon has been associated with mental health or fertility by some of the cultures back then the sun and the moon were treated like some supernatural beings in the sky and so if they disappeared for some time it was considered evil to a primitive mind i can imagine how this may have led to some kind of fears um that um if a pregnant women uh, viewed eclipse it may have similar effect on, on the on her unborn child uh, for example um the face would be disfigured or there would be absence of limbs or there would be birth marks so this created lot of um fear among the general public but there's absolutely no reason to believe any of this uh, since we now know exactly what's a sun what's a moon and how eclipse works it's it's time to leave all those fears and worries away um we have even been to the moon and been back and uh, it's just another rock in the solar system so i would encourage everyone to go out and uh, experience this rare celestial event um, by following safe methods